Do you see my face? Do you see my eyebrows? Hey guys, welcome to or back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Brianna and I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And if you're coming back from a previous video, then thank you so much for coming back. I'm glad to have you all here. So as you can see by the title of today's video, I am going to be trying a brow product on my non-existent eyebrows. So if I look a little different than normal, this is why I have nothing on my eyebrows right now. And like, I don't know if it's just me or like I look completely different with or without eyebrows like I know you guys see my eyebrows like normally how they are like if I start vlogs in the morning or something like that but yeah um this is what my eyebrows look like with nothing on so they're blonde pretty much non-existent and so I am going to be trying a brow product on them today so first off I have to give creds to my girl Weeza because I saw her try out this product and like step by step show how to do it and everything like that on her channel which I'm so grateful for because um, I saw this product probably about a year ago and I just was afraid that I'd mess it up and that my eyebrows would just either look no different or they would be like black and just wouldn't match with my hair or anything and I'd do it wrong so shout out to my girl Lisa because I'm going to be kind of like looking at her video while I'm trying this out on mine but I kind of wanted to do a little review because I see a lot of people who do this like who have decent eyebrows I feel like already but I thought it'd be kind of cool to try it on my like literally non-existent ones and it'd be kind of nice if they were like dyed because then I wouldn't have to pencil them in every single day I've gotten them tinted before but I realized like I don't think tinting was the thing for me because and I feel like it'll be the same with this but we will see um, but tinting like when I use eyebrow pencil it colors my skin in too and I don't have much eyebrow hair and so then I was like oh yeah it kind of just tints the eyebrow hair and I don't have much of that so I'm hoping maybe this will be a little bit different so I am going to be trying out the just for men mustache and beard easy brush in color um coloring thing um this is in the shade m25 light brown it is the lightest shade that they have so I'm hoping it works on me and doesn't put my eyebrows like make them too dark or anything so this comes with a mixing tray color developer ammonia free color base brush and gloves and an instruction leaflet so I'm going to go ahead and um, kind of unbox it for you now it says that all you have to do is brush in wait five minutes and then wash it out um, so it's for like a fuller look um, it's long-lasting and it's for like men who have gray hair but you know what works for some people so I'm hoping it works for me so yeah it comes with like the instructions and then two what did they say like ammonia free things and then um, a new cream formula now with biotin aloe and coconut oil and then the brush to go ahead and just brush the color in whatever this is oh quick start instructions and then a glove and a mixing tray so instead of reading the instructions i'm gonna go off Weeza's video because she gave like a really good step-by-step -step kind of instructions to it so i'm gonna go ahead see what the first step is and get back to you guys okay so after watching it what i have to do is put this color base into the little mixing tray just like a dot so I put like that much if you can see then I have to put the color developer the same amount into this tray as well so here is both of the products together and then I just have to go ahead and mix them and then she said that this one is a little too big um because it's for beards so I actually have this brush that I've never used before so this could be my brush for when I do this to my eyebrows um I've never used this before just because I don't know I didn't have like a use for this but it's in like the set of like brushes I got like makeup brushes for my face so I just have to go ahead and mix the two together the base and the color developer so here that is so she said to start from about like the middle because you want that the darkest and then the lightest so I'm just gonna go ahead and start I'm really nervous like I hope I don't come out with like no eyebrows or like really dark eyebrows but let's just pray and 
see you together. I think though I'm gonna hold up my mirror so that I get a closer view. So I'm brushing up my eyebrows. So let's see. Don't wanna get it on my skin. Okay, so I'm gonna dip and go halfway with like the other eyebrow. This one's looking like kind of normal, just like when I get them wet or something like that. Okay, I gotta make sure to not get it on my actual skin because I don't want that the color of my eyebrow hairs. Okay, so I'm gonna put a little more on just because it doesn't look that dark right now But I don't also want it to be super super like mm, I have like brown or black eyebrows, but I'm just gonna do it super light I'm gonna wipe that off a little. I'm gonna do it super light like where I didn't put it yet so I'm gonna do it kind of again on the like ends of my eyebrows also, I hope no one's watching this for a tutorial because I'm learning how to do it too. Like, I am not a person that you should be watching for a tutorial. I'm not a beauty guru or anything like that. But I just put it on, like, the fronts of my eyebrows now. I do have more hair like on this eyebrow than on this eyebrow so this one might turn out better than this one that's kind of how it was when I tinted my eyebrows so I guess we will see about that okay so I think I'm gonna be done with filling them in with like everything I'm just gonna go ahead and go around them like my skin that has the dye on it this eyebrow has like barely any hair so I'm gonna go a little bit darker on this one and now all we do is wait five minutes and see how this develops and then wipe it off so just set a five minute timer I will see you guys in five minutes. This is how they're looking right now. So I will see you then and hope for me that they're okay. Okay guys, the alarm is just going off and I am scared. Um, do you see my face? Do you see my eyebrows? I'm scared because it just, uh, that's, that's a lot and I think I dyed my skin way too much. Um, really hoping not. I'm just scared and I need to wipe this off. But I'm just making sure I wipe it off with cold water because I grabbed a washcloth and wet it. But I'm just making sure that this is how I do it. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and just do it with a washcloth. I don't really care if this gets dirty, so this could be like my designated washcloth if this thing works out and I end up doing it a lot. So let's just see for, th this is the one I'm nervous about. So let's do the one that I think will turn out okay first. Okay, wait. Okay, like this isn't horrible. Okay, number one, I'm impressed. It kind of, it is a little bit lighter than when I do it like with my brow pencil, but like if I'm wearing makeup with like, and doing my eyebrows, I do my eyebrows a little bit darker so that like my makeup kind of like, you can still see my eyebrows with the makeup on because like I said, they're non-existent. Um, let's see for the second one. making sure I get all the dye off okay wow okay let me just make sure it looks as good as it looks in the camera in my mirror okay so it, there is still like dye I don't think I wiped it off like a ton like this one is definitely better I put a little bit more dye on this one in the first place because my eyebrows like I said are lighter on this side of my like this well you guys are seeing it like it's my right but it's my left um Okay, oh my gosh, so this stuff actually works. There's a little bit more dye that I need to wipe off, but it's honestly like, 
I just it'll wash off like when I wash my face so I think I don't know if I'll like do a little update and update you guys in a few days to see how much it's gone on and I don't think I'm gonna have to use eyebrow pencil the next couple days which is awesome so I hope you guys enjoyed this little review and just seeing me use it for the first time I will link this down below I got it off Amazon for like eight bucks which is a super good deal and I literally used a drop so this will last me like many times doing this so yeah here is the final result wow I'm actually impressed it's good it's a little bit darker than when I got them tinted which I'm happy about and next time I can also do them a little bit darker so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it too don't forget to give this video a like comment down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next one bye guys